Magneto. Alright, there's gonna be an interesting one right here. But actually, all matches are interesting over here because it's always uh, something new that's happening over here. So, where the fuck is Retro Pig? Right there. Oh, we're getting, we're getting a button check right now. Okay, so it's gonna be a uh, very eventful for both of us. We'll be setting up. Yo, thank you so much, Katan420, for the gifted sub. Let's go. Yo. Yo, Cranky1, if you in the chat, go ahead and use your emotes right now. Yeah, my boy. Yeah, he made top eight again. Retro has been consistently playing very well every time. This guy is just insane at times. All right, now we're really getting into it. Three, two, one, go! All right. Pokemon Stadium for the first game. And we got Dragneel. Oh shit, my boy PK and G's hopping on the fucking mic. It's your boy. It's your boy in the house. <laughs> Let's go both players with Dragneel a little bit more. Yeah, and uh, Retro Fix once again showing his ass. I'm, I'm always excited to see more Retro Fix stuff. And uh, Dragneel hasn't, hasn't been down for a while, but he's been talking head in the chat for like three months straight. And it showed up with his pilot Tana. Uh, making a nice losers run, it looks like. Yeah, I think they won play lives. Got you, man. They won play, yeah, they won play lives, so they're they're a little hot right now. They're following us. Caught a few bodies. Who did, uh, who did they take it over? I don't know. I'm looking gonna look that up. People. <laughs> people that played worse than they did. He good, though. That's all I gotta say. Both of these guys, they playing, uh, for money right now. You know what I mean? They playing for keeps. Absolutely, and this is obviously the pre warm up to Super GLS, which is completely, completely stacked. Um, this GLS is so. stacked as hell. And it hit, it hit, uh, it hit maps, it hit cap uh, capacity. So thank you guys for coming out to the GLS. But damn, look at this. Retro Picks holding on to that stock. Dragneel was in the lead, but slowly inching their way is Retro Picks with the F smash of, the, of his life. Yeah, no, he's looking really good. Um, Dragneel. Ooh. Kind of, kind of playing off, understanding that Charizard will take that stock really fast. Yeah. Uh, here's hoping uh, Retrofix has learned a little bit more about closing because a Ooh. lot of the time, yeah, that failed leg trump didn't get, but sometimes Retrofix has uh, uh, trouble taking stocks off. Hopefully a nice step to the ledge. Yeah, Hold you got to close it. We'll do it. Very good, very uh -huh. good stuff. But Dragneel is just a little bit there. Yeah. Um, Any smash attack could kill. Yeah, looking for a hard read there with that... Uh, uh, now smash. Wait, there we go. A nice back air. Putting the pressure on uh, Dragneel right now. Retro pick looking really good and confidently playing. You have to be really confident to play Squirtle at these high percentages. Look at that, man. 75% going for the neutral air. Not going to catch the teleport. A lot of sheesh action going Slightly on. Slightly there, but not going to catch it. Yeah. I think that's a really good idea because, you know, the teleport. Thank you so much, I But yeah, like I was saying, the teleport, you know where they're gonna end up. So if you cover it with a, a lasting hitbox, like the neutral air from Ivysaur. Ow. And can we talk about how he's at 135% right now? Yeah, he's holding on to that uh, advantage state on that first stock. What a great up smash out of shield. Yeah, Dragneel seems to be at a little bit of a loss. Um, I think he's respecting Retro Fix just a little bit too much. Um, he really needs to take the stock because uh, I'm Retro's not, looking I'm not fantastic. seeing any Palu shit. No, not really. And I think the Dragneel uh, is usually playing the uh, Beyblades, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so I'm not seeing, a, you know, the bread and butter Palu shit right now. Yeah, but like approaching with Nair more often. His, his neutral is so solid that he he's doing fine without it. Um, I would say I kind of disagree a little bit. I think that it's really important. I think obviously because uh, Squirtle has really small hitboxes, it's 
it's a lot harder to uh, approach with the with the nair so he hasn't been approaching maybe that that might be the reason but maybe he just needs to get his footing i don't know who he's been playing for most of the tournament but uh obviously there's quite the discrepancy between uh the ages as compared to valentina i know dragneo has a lot of confidence in Palutena. um yeah uh let's hope that that starts to uh, show up a little bit more because it doesn't feel like it, but a back Ooh, air, great switch, going to save it. And Retro being, oh wow, great down tilt. What that was a two legend. frame down tilt right there. It was nothing Retro picks could do. Absolutely nothing. He tried to go for the low recovery, which was the right option, but yeah. Dragneel had that covered. And now it's still looking really doable for Dragneel. 85%. That's nothing but a little love and rage. Absolutely. You know what's crazy? It looks like Retro Fix is now respecting Dragneel. He's all oh, hell now. What yeah. the fuck? I was up 3-1. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I that's, was up 3-1, bro. That's a huge mental block for a player that, that, you know, was ahead by such a large margin is now could, could die at any given moment. But great stuff. Does the F smash the ledge? It's gonna take game one going to retro picks and uh, lose round eight. Very nice. Yeah, I'm glad he cleaned that up because that can be that can be mad embarrassing. Yeah, it's cool to look all cute and shit, but sometimes you gotta close up shop. Yeah, he'll take you to the closed up shop. Oh, you gotta be like, sorry, I'm refusing service. <laughs> I don't wanna see you after hours. I'm gonna end the stock real quick. Oh God, get out of the store. We are closed. So yeah, our scrub looking see, really good. What counter pick did they pick? Did they go back to Pokemon Stadium? I want to say they went back to Pokemon Stadium. Oh, the Beyblades are coming now. We got the well, nice black skin. Yeah. Back at a. Uh, back at a. Uh, yeah, and I do think that the Palu worked pretty well. I just think that there needs to be a little bit of warmth. But, but I also I feel, also feel like the Beyblades don't have a losing matchup. So no, you know, they do not. Play, playing but this with the way the retro is playing. No, wow, like, that's a side B. He has a side B. Oh, oh, he has to side B again. He's not going to make it. Oh, what a... <laughs> Yo, what a base. That is, that is, uh, I'm that get, is amazing I'm awareness, get bro. I'm going to get this bitch wet. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. She's leaking. She's soaking wet. She's leaking. She's losing stocks. Fantastic uh, stuff. I love it here. Love it here. Retro Picks is playing out of his mind. I can tell that he's been, like, grinding a lot. Um, Dragneel. That was, that was so predictable, though, like... You're gonna double jump, burn that double jump. You got a side B. Absolutely. Go for the water gun. Fuck yeah. it. Yeah, and honestly, I just think the retro pick is playing really well right now. Because look at him catching that air dodge to ledge. He's gotta get Down back. there! Oh, oh shit! God. Yeah! Yo! Hey, yo, retro yo. pick is going stupid. My boy going crazy. Absolutely dummy. Hey, I joined my matchup. Hey, yeah. <laughs> I'm dead. Hey, talk that talk. Yeah, no, retro pick is looking fantastic. Drag Neil has to figure something out. We're gonna um, have to prescribe my boy some medication because he's going crazy right now. Retro picks. She's calling out these shield grabs and everything. It's beautiful stuff. Like, you know. Oh, right. Damn. Yeah, now finally, Dragnil saying, I'm not out of this yet. Kill him with a nair. It's but, the uh, same position he was in that last game. Uh, he, yeah. he was down three stocks to one and then brought it back. I think maybe Retro Pick's getting a little too comfortable with the lead that he has. Playing really I don't unsafe. think so. That was a really good SBI. He's kind of um, mashing right now. Yeah, he's getting mashed on for sure. And I think a big part of this is uh, Retro Pick's learning that he needs to be able to close out stocks when he's two stocks ahead. Uh, you know? the, the Beyblades do a better job at doing it. Absolutely. And look at this. Yeah. And I'm loving this patience in these aerials, setting up these... Uh, uh, very weird scenarios where uh, Dragneel's having trouble landing. Yeah, but, that's, a, that's a free stock. Yeah, that's definitely uh -huh. a free stock. You can't play on the edge like that with a with Ivasaur. He was supposed to hop back on stage, and then he was like, ooh, this ledge looking nice. Big exactly. ass Xeno Blade sword for your ass. And you can see Dragneel starting to oh. call out some of these. Oh, 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 oh hey. no way! Oh, oh my god! god. Fucking that was clean. Disgusting. That was absolutely disgusting. You, if he actually didn't do that second jab reset, hey yo, it, yo, hey, yo, yo, had it, oh had my he, god, 